tibia tibia that is another typical long bone present in the leg region of lower limb tibia has you can say because of it is a long bone it has three part upper end shaft and lower end it is also known as shin bone why it is known as shin bone because it has one anterior sharp border and because of that it is also known as shin bone tibia that is a medial typical long bone of the leg it is compared with upper limb that is radius bone tibia has three part that is upper end upper end that is expanded end and it has two condyles these two condyles they are forming the knee joint with the femoral condyles tibia has you can say lower end lower end that is a smaller and has one prominence that is situated on the medial side that is known as medial malleolus in side determination of tibia we must know characteristic of upper end characteristic of lower end and characteristic of you can say shaft one very important point for upper end tibia has you can say two condyles they are known as tibial condyle forming a knee joint with the femoral condyle and has at the anterior side it has one tuberosity that is known as tibial tuberosity one of lower end tibia has one downward prominence downward prominence that is situated on medial side that is known as medial malleolus the shaft that is a prismoid in shape and because of that it has three border anterior border medial border and lateral border shaft of the tibia has one anterior crest like prominent border that is s in shape and it is also known as shin of tibia the anatomical position tibia held in vertical in vertical position it has upper end with tibial tuberosity anteriorly shaft with s shape crest like border shin of tibia anteriorly and one malleolus at the level of lower end there is situated on medial side because of this upper end has anteriorly tuberosity sheen of tibia anterior border anteriorly and malleolus medially so this tibia that is a left sided tibia fibula fibula that is a lateral long bone of you can say leg in the lower limb it is very thin bone as compared to tibia fibula that is compared with ulna bone of upper limb fibula that is a typical long bone and because of that it has upper end lower end and one thin shaft fibula has upper end shaft and lower end at the level of upper end you can see it is expanded in all direction plus it has one articular facet or articular surface at the level of you can say superior side at the upper end of fibula there is one prominence present that is known as styloid process lower end of fibula the so lower end of fibula that is you can say flattened from side to side lower end there is one prominence there is one prominence that is known as lateral malleolus at the lower end here you can see one triangular facet that is mostly situated medially as well as anteriorly and there is one fossa exactly behind the triangular facet means the posterior side of lower end of fibula there is one pit or you can say fossa that is known as malleolar fossa fibula has one point for upper end 
वन पॉइंट फॉर लोअर एंड एंड वन पॉइंट फॉर शाफ्ट एट द लेवल ऑफ अपर एंड हियर यू कैन सी देर इज आर्टिक्युलर फेसेट और आर्टिक्युलर सरफेस सुपीरियरली एंड स्टाइलॉइड प्रोसेस दिस अपर एंड एक्सपांडेड इन ऑल डायरेक्शन एट द लोअर एंड इट इज यू कैन से फ्लैटन फ्रॉम मीडियल टू लेटरल साइड और यू कैन से साइड टू साइड इट हैज वन आर्टिक्युलर फेसेट फॉर टीबिया एंटेरो मीडियली एंड देर इज वन यू कैन से फोसा एक्जेक्टली पोस्टीरियर टू दी फेसेट दैट इज नोन एज मेल्योलर फोसा दिस मेल्योलर फोसा दैट इज वेरी इम्पॉर्टंट लैंडमार्क फॉर साइड डिटर्मिनेशन ऑफ फिब्यूला शाफ इज वेरी थीन एंड डेलिकेट पिन लाइक स्ट्रक्चर ओके इट इज सिचुएटेड इन बिटवीन अपर एंड एंड लोअर एंड एंड कम्बिनेशन ऑफ फिब्यूला हियर यू कैन सी अपर एंड दैट इज एक्सपांडेड with you can say styloid process and articular surface at the level of superior this one vertical shaft and main characteristic unique point at the lower end that is facet medially and posterior side there is a mellular fossa and because of that this one right sided fibula and this one left sided fibula anatomical position fibula held vertically in short tibia and fibula in anatomical position they held vertically